The Pfizer vaccine is possibly weeks away from getting emergency use approval by the FDA. Community Hospital in Munster announced it will be among the first in Indiana to receive the vaccine. It was chosen because of its ability to store the first doses. The Pfizer vaccine needs to be stored at at least minus 70 degrees Celsius. Most commercial freezers cannot handle that kind of cold temperature. It's the kind of storage that Dr. Robert Citrenberg says is rare and expensive. The infectious disease medical director of Advocate Aurora Health says some of his hospitals have the capability, but the system plans to buy more freezers. At this point, the state has not announced which Illinois hospitals will be the first to get the Pfizer vaccine. There is a state process to follow. Well, everyone who is going to be part of this vac COVID vaccine effort uh, has to enroll and sign up and go through the training and accept to, you know, prioritize the patients in the way that we're um, recommending. Healthcare workers and first responders are likely to be the first. Major drugstore chains like Walgreens and CVS say they will have the capability to store the Pfizer vaccine. However, ultra cold freezers are not needed for short term storage. Now the Pfizer vaccine will be shipped on dry ice. So there will be a period of time where it can be stored in their storage containers. The good news is by the time the vaccine is distributed to the masses, there will be many more vaccines on the market that will not require the kind of storage the Pfizer vaccine needs. None of the others need to be stored in such cold temperatures. They are expected to be easier to distribute. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.